Oh yeah, life is good. Life is real good. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't like setting in canola, but this bare spot going through here had a lot of coyote tracks in it. In December, these would be pure white. Get a couple snaps. I'm gonna get by, Bob. Well, this is really exciting. Um, a very, very distinct lion track. And just like the bobcat, just like the felines, their hind foot often steps really close to their front foot. And you can see the weight of this guy, he sunk in. You can see the shape of the pad here. The pad's different than the canine. And there is no X like you find with a canine. Well, we had a really good day. 13 coyotes and three fox. Well, this next set is the one where I promised you it would have a muskrat or I would eat a small jar of high water. And so I'm not nervous. I'm not sweating it. Very confident at this point in time. I could go to a trapping convention and buy this trap for maybe $25. Hanging here is priceless though. It's part of history. I'm part of the history. Bart is part of the history. And we're probably the only ones that know it's here. Holy <laughs> Now back in my youth, me and my buddy Toad, we'd trap together, and if you caught a muskrat, you would yell out, muskrat, and you'd shake your fist in the air like that, and, and it got the stupider sound and the better. It was just... Wide white belly is what you want. That's what, the, that's what the high dollar ones are. And like you said, we're conservationists. We want to have the woods. We want to have clean water. We want to have animals. But we we use the animals because they're a renewable resource. <laughs> He's very local.